Hi Aries, welcome to your weekly forecast and this is for August 15th until 22nd. Now let's take a look. I'm actually preparing for a um, past life reading for all the signs. So for the meanwhile, I'll be delivering you your weeklies, okay? Alright. It's so hard when we're actually under the umbrella of two retrogrades. Mercury and Mars. Which will both end on um, August. <clears throat> okay. Ooh, Aries. Looks like you're going to be joining your relatives or your family for a small gathering this week. But we'll be pulling out more clarifications on this, okay? Alright. Let's take a look at your finances. Let me adjust the resolution of the camera. I think that's a little better now. Oh, working so hard. And looks like you are about to achieve the rewards of your hard labor or your efforts. Mm -mm -mm. Oof, success is almost there, okay? You are working on a project or in an achievement that you will be celebrating soon. And this is really meant for you to have. Alright. Let's take a look at your health. I just need to go organic and go for something natural or and stop eating some processed or you know, food that you just put in the microwave. I can't say it's artificial, but it's more likely food that's full of preservatives. Okay. And I also feel like spending time near the water or water therapy or swimming therapy will also be doing good to you this weekend. Plus, you also need to be a little bit more thankful or offer something to whatever religion you have to be thankful for good health, good life, and good finances. Alright, lovers. Looks like you're going to be having some active, intimate week. Alright. Be positive about your love life. You are going to be renewing your connection. And this could be the one. Now, singles, if you are dating somebody right now, which is an air sign, then definitely this is the right one for you. Not to mention that you will both feel comfortable being intimate, physical, and being who you really are right in front of this person, okay? then this is actually the right one for you to end up in a relationship. Although don't rush things, okay? If this person doesn't want to commit for now. But it will end up eventually in a commitment. Alright. Now, looks like you're going to be invited in a family gathering or a small intimate party or gathering by your relative or family member and I feel like there is something that you will be celebrating not to mention that when it comes to your finances you will slowly have that achievement or fulfillment okay that you've been working so hard for the past few weeks or months and I feel like there will be a celebrate there will be a double celebration as well uh, there is a possibility of you announcing that you just got promoted, you just got the job, you just got the project, or you got the um, you got granted of something that you've been like <clears throat> trying to get for the past few months or weeks. Now, this week will be very, very good for you. And for those who's, who's trying to conceive or trying to get pregnant, this is also a very fertile time for you. All right. So if you really want to go that way, or um, try to start a family then this is the perfect week for you since that you will also be very active in sex okay this week and i feel like you will start thinking and pondering about where your life is going 
in a certain situation and that you're ready for the next level now if you are with a water sign i feel like this you know this type of relationship or this type of situation or this type of um marriage or relationship that you're in I feel like this person will start compromising soon and will start giving way, understanding, being more vocal about their emotions, about their intent and whatever that's in their mind. Because I feel like the communication has been a problem to you in the past and there has been some gaps or like misunderstandings that when the other person said something else, you interpret it as another thing. Okay, and that is where the fight always comes from. Now this thing, I feel like if you are partnered with a water sign, uh, there is, well, there is a certain problem, situation, or like a, like an immaturity or issue before that they want to leave it all behind and they want to start all over again and they want you to understand and see their effort, okay? So just try to be a little bit more appreciative of their actions because don't push for perfection. Just appreciate what they can give to you and what they can provide to you, okay? I also feel like you will be concentrating more on your family area this week. And um, I don't feel like you'll be able to spend time with a friend or with some, you know, uh, let's say colleagues. If you're going to be invited for a, for a night out or drinking session, especially for men. Now, when it comes to your work, I feel like, Aries, this is the time that you will be, you know, that you will be um, f appreciating yourself more with the perseverance, the patience, and, I mean, the attitude of waiting, okay, of being patient. You have fought so hard for this... Um, for this position and for this uh, opportunity even though it your health have already paid it off and um, also be careful and getting so burned out and stressed out this week is there is a possibility that you will you know that you'll get sick and I feel like stop looking back into the past okay victory will soon be yours and I feel like even if up to the last minute it will almost slip off it will still be yours it will still be granted expect some delays except um expect some um postponement but it will still be yours it will still pursue okay now when it comes to your health i feel like you need to um i feel like you need to spend more time near the water or at least you know run or walk near the water just to feel the uh, the energy and to have your energy cleansed and detoxify your mind because you've been under a lot of stress for the past few weeks and months and i feel like this time it will give you a little bit more energy or give you a little bit or give you a different breeze okay Family gatherings, this will also give you the strength to continuously persevere and prove yourself that, you know, you're not that person that they expect you to be. Because some, let's just say that some family members or some relative of yours doesn't really believe in your capability. And this is the perfect time for you to prove that you are more than what they have expected you to be. All right. Be careful of heights, be careful of high places, be careful in tripping off the ladder or stairs, and be careful of vertigo, okay? Aside from that, be careful in the air that you breathe, secondhand smoking, smoking, or, uh, you know, the thing that you smoke, the, the vape thing. I feel like you will also have some skin allergies if someone will be blowing that smoke on you or you're the one who's smoking it. Now, when it comes to your health, uh, sorry, when it comes to your sex life, um, you will have a very active, sexually filled week this week, okay? Um, especially for those singles, I feel like you're going to be actively seeing somebody from Friday until Sunday, uh, whether they're single or married okay but you will have a very active sex week and i feel like this is also the start of something new like for example feeling 
feeling like in love or feeling emotional about this person because you are slowly um what do you call this molding your I can't call it yet as a foundation, but it's more the, the connection, the chemistry, which is, it also appeared in your uh, Romance Angel cards, okay? Avoid being so obsessed about this person or avoid for this person to be so obsessed to you and um, try to curb down the, um, the jealousy and too much confrontation because you're not yet in a relationship and you're not yet there. So don't change the situation by acting too much. All right. Now, for those who's already married or partnered, if you are, as, as I've said, if you're trying to conceive, this is a perfect time for you to start planning ahead because you're going to be very fertile this month. Uh, sorry, this week, and you are. There is a high possibility of you getting a positive result. Okay, and not to mention that both of you are in the groove. Now, romance angel cards. Stay positive about your life. Stay positive about your marriage, your relationship, or with the person that you're dating. Have some faith, okay? Just don't push for perfection. Don't push for things to go your way. Learn how to be patient. It will take some time, a little bit, but um, things will actually fall into place at their right time and place, okay? And... Um, you will have that intense connection, longing, and missing each other. And it's like you will eventually feel that you were thinking both at the same time, same thing. And, you know, you will have that same brain waves. Like, for example, that you start thinking about somebody, that person will just started ringing you or sending you a message. That kind of connection. And, you know, for singles, this could be the one, especially if you're dating an air sign. Now, for those married ones who are already in a committed relationship, things will start getting better. There has been a lot of arguments, gaps, and almost on the verge of breaking up. But then this week, I feel like this is the start of your communications getting better. And expect that your partner will still be acting a little bit stubborn like how they used to. But you will have that extra length of patience. And instead of fighting, you will just keep on getting quiet, which your partner will, you know, definitely get it. Now, as for your Oracle cards, Knight of Michael, time to move quickly. Choose logic over emotions, sudden changes. Now, three of Ariel. Do what you love, a time of great personal growth in your career or artistic endeavors, working with others in a cooperative manner, which as I told you, you're, you're and you know, the things that you've been working around your, your profession for the past few weeks, months, or days, it will definitely pay off. Now, 10 of Ariel, there's so very much to be grateful for. Financial success and the promise of retirement, a rich and rewarding family life. Well, family life, talk about pregnancy, okay? So, so anyway, that's it for you for this week, Aries. And if you want to have your own personal readings, go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net and visit destinypsychics.com. All right, blessings.